Welcome, welcome, welcome. What's up, Buttercup? I just started. Don't get them knocking on the freaking door. Kaden. Why? I don't know. I was being a pain in the butt. Well, I can't freaking hear him when you made me freaking get out when I was only in there for 10 minutes and I literally had to rush to wash my conditioner because Kaden was knocking on the door like 10 times. Okay, I'm sorry. Well, seriously, you had to rush me out of there. Okay. <laughs> okay. Say, I didn't even get to like... Why don't you say hi to everybody? No. I love you. Why not? <laughs> what? So annoying, dude. Okay. Any hoozy. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Sunday night. Looking into Monday. Okay. That's good, bro. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> oh, so much fun. There's so much fun. Yep, not. Fun, oh my gosh, it's Look at her butt. It is so, so big. big. <laughs> All right. We got the eight of wands. Bound, 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 Feisty. Look at her. Look at her. Queen hasn't come out of this deck in a long time. <clears throat> I don't know. I don't know. And then you pulled Destiny. And then you pulled Destiny. That's that's kind of a big deal. <laughs> that's kind of a big deal, troops. It's like you're getting... This is like a... Okay. So the Eight of Wands to me is always, always a journey. I know to a lot of other people, it's, you know, messaging, internet, that type of stuff. Um, hold on. <clears throat> Why am I supposed to wear her freaking shirt to go to bed? I put away a lot of t-shirts to I, I could have possibly put them in the wrong drawer. Remember that Patriot sweatshirt? Monday, Monday. You have a Patriot sweatshirt? Yeah. Um, I don't know what I'm talking about. I do. I, I think I put it in one of your drawers. Oh, yeah. I'll hold this one. Let's see. Got the Hyra font. Mitzi, me. No. Coming in as the father. the overall energy between the between us what's the overall, overall energy? energy overall energy you got thought for the overall energy you got the ace of wands at the bottom of the deck ace of swords sorry about that um so this could all be a thought or you're gonna have to put I'm going downstairs for a little. A lot of thought into this. Oh, right. I'm just going to sit in the kitchen while we eat. Okay. So. What I'm going to do is pull your best advice versus clarifying because I don't want to just I'm definitely not hmm. you're gonna get a message okay it's either coming from the queen of, of air okay or 
a hierophant type energy, somebody who's non traditional, spiritual, usually references you know, non non traditional just it could there could be a lesson not a lesson, there's destiny. It's like a spiritual destiny, but the the thing is, the way the Hierophant's coming in it reminds me of an energy more than a Hierophant. It's definitely higher. Hmm. Say higher learning. So about this, okay, best advice for the eight of wands. Let's just I, I want to just do it this way. Best advice for the eight of wands. So there is something destined to go down. Good, bad, happy, sad. It it it's just it's destined. So let's see what this message is. And I don't know if I finished. I almost saying the eight of wands is always a spiritual journey to me. And there's definitely a journey here. Getting on the right path. So Monday, Monday, Monday. Best advice for the eight of wands. Bam, 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 bam. We got new vision and going with the flow. So if somebody has a new idea, or you do, a, a new, well, new vision, right? Which is more than thought. Somebody's seeing something. So make sure whatever this is for you guys, okay, it's it's definitely regarding your destiny. Okay, so go with the flow. Best advice for the queen of you. So either you're going to put something together or somebody else put something together. Obviously, your overall energy is thought, so you're going to have to put some thought into it. Tell me about the Queen of Air. Best advice for the Queen of Air. Yeah. Just doing a video. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'll be out in like five, ten minutes. Yeah, never mind. Okay. I'll be out in five, ten minutes. Best advice for the Queen of Air. I knew I heard her say court. I thought I was losing my mind. Best advice for the Queen of Air. There might be a little chaos in your life tomorrow, but not a big deal. So celebration, happiness, dating, going out to dinner, celebrating, just could even be good news. Whatever it is, it's going to make you happy, and this is your best advice, and the universe is telling you to, to celebrate, be happy about it. You're allowed to be happy. You're allowed to put a smile on your face, whatever this is regarding. Best advice for destiny. Dun, 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 dun. Oh yeah, it was nice and calm in the household. Then Lonnie left and then all of a sudden like Mia came in. I don't know, so you might have a little chaos. But I wouldn't worry about it. Definitely, I mean you're going to put thought into it, but you should be happy about it. Best advice for destiny. That's way too many. Best advice for destiny. So you must that you're at rebirth and awareness. So you obviously went through a transformation. This is major. It's a rebirth. It's a brand new you. You're either already aware of it or you're going to be fully aware of something tomorrow. Well, I'm saying Monday energy, right? But, you know, this is... This is current energy. You got something flowering too, blooming. This might not necessarily happen tomorrow, or it can. It really just depends. I mean, this could have already happened. So, best advice for the higher font. This is somebody you're dealing with for some reason. And the higher fats 
you know, speaks of a lot of, a lot of things. But you got creativity. It's almost like the Empress energy too. That's okay. This could have to do at work, having the Empress come out, because this could be a boss, spiritual work, anything non-traditional. Um, taboo, you know? Could be regarding work. If somebody sees something or you see something, go with the flow. You're going to be happy. Destiny, you, whatever this is, you're ready. Something's going to come into full awareness for you soon. Might, like I said, it might not be tomorrow, but it's, it's current energy for whoever this read is for. It, you know, regardless of the Empress, it's you can create. It's like, it's not the magician energy, but it's, you know, you can create. You're, you're the Empress. This could be a person, a, a, a male figure, whomever he is, and it's saying he's spiritual. This would be a spiritual connection. Stop. Put the gummy. Stop. Collaborate Stop. and listen. Stop. Put the gummy bears away. I'm grabbing a few. I feel like we've had gummy bears in this house for months now. I don't even understand. Mom has the flu. Oh, bite your tongue. Take a fast shower. Fast shower. You taking a shower? Yes. Okay. We'll get it done. Okay. And be quick. Yeah, this was like 25 minutes. I, I don't want to. Kate and John. Stuff to do. I don't got stuff to do. Hey, I'm doing this. Shut the door. All I have to do is plug in my Chromebook. Well, go plug in your Chromebook for school tomorrow, please. That's the only thing I need to do. Well, get on it. Best advice for thought. So you're going to give this some thought. But the universe is saying, you know, you can create something. Like, either somebody has a new vision or you're going to have a new vision. Go with the flow. You're going to be happy. It's okay to smile. Because you're coming in as Queen of Swords energy, right? So it makes me think, like, you're more... Um, it's more intellectual energy, more mental, more sharp versus, you know, love or action or, you know, grounded. It's all of them, but, like, this is mainly her focus. Dun, 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 dun. Tell me about best advice for thought. I really, I never look at the Hierophant as somebody where it's like dating. I, I look at them more as like other stuff, like a priest, somebody in the public eye, you know, it, it's something like that, but it seems to be a spiritual connection, person, plays a thing. And then with thought, you got abundance, okay? So it's like having abundance, you know, twice, happiness, okay? So think happy thoughts, think abundant thoughts. Don't get overwhelmed. Best advice for this awareness, because I, I I feel like this best advice for awareness, please. So whatever comes your way, big, small, you know. Um You pulled the rebel. <clears throat> so this is, whatever this is, it's definitely stepping outside your comfort zone. You're going to need to be a rebel. 
I don't give a, you know, that type of energy as long as you love what you're doing. It's got to be a big deal. There's got to be some controversy here regarding something. Okay. So, or this is an energy that went through a rebirth and they're going after their destiny. It, it really just depends on who it's linked to. Okay. So, it looks great. So, whatever comes your way. This is your best advice. It looks like messaging, emails, text messages. It's a journey. It, it's something important. It's a big deal. This isn't like, hey, I'm going on a journey. I, I mean, yeah, but like, I don't know. Maybe you, you go to bed and these are you. No, it's not a dream card. But like, this could happen in your dream state. And you wake up a brand new person. But I'm not really going to go down like that. I'm just, just trying to be more practical than anything. But this is definitely some type of message coming in. Go with the flow. Create. And I'm literally saying, like, it's okay to be happy because I, just because of this energy. Because I, I this is more laid back, like, not wanting to rush jack schnit, you know, that type of energy. But you can create. That's for sure. And when you're thinking, make sure you're happy. Happy thoughts. Nothing negative. For some of you, this would be tomorrow or be like definitely within a week because it's current. And some of you will just wake up. I mean, it, the Eight of Wands is the first card out. You just wake up and, and great energy. And I, I was thinking dreamlike because I'm looking at it as like more or less like there was some type of vision or your dream was very was said lucid so it really just depends but it looks more or less communication stepping outside the box being able to create something you know you being a rebel is definitely going outside your comfort zone okay so just you know be positive um, I almost said be aggressive, be, be aggressive, taking me back to my little cheerleading days. I think be aggressive came out early in one of the reads. It could have been the ones I did, the private one. Oh, it was be assertive. <laughs> but I'm mean, saying be aggressive, so be aggressive, be, be aggressive, which is basically telling me it's an opportunity and... You should always go after what you want. As long as it's a practical thought, guys. With whatever this is regarding. I'm not telling y'all to go be psychos. Okay? Don't do that. <laughs> Don't go there. Don't go there. Alright, it looks good. I'll see you tomorrow too, though. Okay? But, um, I just felt like doing a little spread for you guys. So, here it is. Boom, chakalaka, boom, chakalaka, boom. Pow. That wasn't very good. Pow, boom. Yeah, no. You can tell that my energy is drained. <laughs> I tried. I tried, though. I love you. Uh, hold on. I really need to say something real quick. Everybody's doing a brand new dance now. Come on, baby, do the locomotion. I know you get to like it if you give it a chance now. Well, that's that's way too many. Just want one more. Just want one more. So come on, come on, do the locomotion with me. There's maturity here. 
it's also saying, because I was clarifying the rebel, so it's also saying you needed to reach this type of maturity to even, to even go there. Basically, you're ready, whatever this is. Or this could be another person coming in as the rebel, you know, doing... Because to me, this is more stepping outside of the comfort zone, um, taking a risk. There is subtype, subtype of uh, maturity here, for sure. All right, y'all. Y'all ready for this? I love you. I'll see you manana. Have a fantastic rest of your night. Bye, troops.